Yo, what's up? This is Series here, and today, well, wait, let me talk about the giveaway first. Oh, yeah, hello, guys. It's Series here, and today I'm bringing you with another commentary with a Black Light Retribution, and this time, you know the game on the PS4, and you know, um, I would just like to know your opinions on this game, and today I'm going to be giving you my opinions on the PS4. Well, honestly, the PS4 is a very great console, I will admit that. There you go, console. I like the way you can record gameplay on the flash drive. I'll, that's how I'm able to bring you this PS4 gameplay right here. And, you know, so, um, you know, my opinions on the PS4 is actually that, um, it's really, really, really good. It's a really great, really great console. It's a really good console, but the thing about it is, I'm a, I just don't like that it don't have YouTube on it. Because if they had YouTube on it, honestly, it would be a little bit of a better console. You know, because I wouldn't have to put it on a flash drive and then take off space on my flash drive. I might have to want to do on my flash drive. Mm, this is not going to be a rant, but um, I'm just saying it could have had YouTube, you know, since you know you can stream straight to Twitch. You could just have it like, you can like edit your videos and then after that render them because they got its own personal video editing thing on there, which is very amazing for those people who don't feel like using things like Sony Vegas or something. But if you into that though, you can just render it on the PS4 and then just take it off the PS4 and then just put it onto your computer and then put it on YouTube. But it would be much easier if you can just edit it and then just upload to YouTube from the console. But I guess they ain't thought of that yet. But, but I guess that's just me, you know. <laughs> okay, um. This is like um shooting that guy right there. Oh just got just got grenaded. Well with a PS4 I will admit is a really great console. I'm saying that again because it is great. It is great. And another thing I have to say about it is that um I need to do a little bit of tweaks and stuff to the console. It's not all of it feels complete though. It feels more complete than the Xbox One. I've actually used the Xbox One. I don't own the Xbox One, but my brother has the Xbox One. And he loves Xbox, so I cannot really say nothing for him. I only went through with the PS4 for this generation of consoles because, well, the PS4 looked like a better deal. <laughs> better deal, not because of the price difference, because of the way it just seems like a full... Let me think of what I'm saying. It's a full console, that's what I'm just saying. It's just a full console. It just feels like it's complete, but missing a few key details that needs it, that can, you know, help it appeal to more people like YouTubers and a little bit more, even though YouTubers still use this, I mean, like, like, so it can make it easier for, like, YouTubers and stuff, make it easier for Twitch people, people who do go on Twitch, I will give you a thumbs up, <laughs> give you a thumbs up, like a really good thumbs up, because y'all, y'all, yeah, y'all, good luck. <laughs> y'all are really lucky. But, um, still, overall, I can say this is a very great console. If I could show you a picture right now of the console, well, but since y'all already know what the console probably looks like, I should probably already know it. And basically, I don't want to sound like this thing has all cons, but one thing. I just wanted to point out that con, because this is basically a pros and cons video of the PS4. Well, let's move on to the pros. Basically, one thing that's a pro about the um, PS4 is about that it's, um, it feels complete, like I said. It feels complete, you know, it got the interface is snappy and easy to use if it just, um, take a minute to just, um, a chance to know how to do stuff, you know. The interface is very clean, instantly, you know, do multiple things at once, have multiple things running in the background, it goes instantly straight back to it, it's actually pretty nice. And then, also, when you want to go on Netflix or something, you know, I'm always going on Netflix, I love Netflix. Then you can, like, um, the game basically, like, suspends itself, and then next time you play, you can, like, uh, easily just go back to the game and then just play it. You know, go back to the starting screen, you can just... Um, and if you like playing Call of Duty or something, or a single player game, just go instantly back to starting screen, and then you just, you know, start up a game or something. You know, start up the game. It's actually 
pretty great. I will admit, that's a great feature um, on the PS4, but the Xbox One does that too. Well, just that I don't really like the PS, the, the Xbox One, because I don't feel it's necessary. Even though the price has dropped, you know, to three ninety nine, like the PlayStation Four, it's just not necessary. The PS4, to me, the exclusives are better a little bit because mostly every Here's one pro right here. Mostly all the developers are mainly making games for the PS4. The PS4, there's some exclusives on the Xbox, but they're not really interesting. Well, maybe besides Halo, but I'm not a friend of Halo. I'm not really a fan of Halo. I hate Halo for some reason. Oh, and by the way, if y'all like to leave a comment on that, uh, you get mad at me. I'm not a Halo fan. Uh, Please don't troll on the comments saying that um, I'm a douchebag. You're a I can't say that word because I'm a 14 year old and I'm very respectful. <laughs> okay. Okay, well. Well, this video is about to wrap up, but I'm not gonna um, say that I always do at the end 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. But, um. <laughs> uh, let me just say this. Um. Just, um Contours is very great. I will say that. I have said this a lot during the video, but it is a great console, though. Plus, I, I, I just really love the fact that I can um get my gameplay off a of flash drive and then put it onto YouTube. That's just one of the most greatest things this console can give me. It, it really is. And it really just helps me, um, because I don't have a capture card yet, and it just really helps me do what I do. You know, it really helps me do what I do, and then, man, I'm just really glad about that. <laughs> but those are mainly all the programs or cons I can really think of. Um, most of the cons are mainly related to what I do. Like, if you, if I put this on, like, the Next video, I'm going to probably talk about YT Gamers, because I actually, it actually feels great talking about giving your opinions on something. YT Gamers, I'm going to talk about that, and it looked like we were defeated, and I put, did the fist bump, though. Oh, and I was actually doing pretty good towards the end. Like my opinions video, next one I'm going to do on YT Gamers, and some of these YT people, YT Gamers people will probably agree with me with some of these opinions when I post it on there in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's go, guys. Um, series here. Um, and you know, if you want to subscribe, you can subscribe. Or if you want to click those two videos, you can. You know, um, click those two, click those two annotations, and click the subscribe annotations, and then you, then those two videos take you to to those videos, and those and that subscribe button will yeah, will subscribe to me. And you know, um, if you really like this video, you know, like, favorite, subscribe, and you know, you know, stay tuned for series, videos. Love you guys. See ya. Series out.